um, this is a quick video um, showing my recent uh, purchases from TJ Maxx and Marshalls. TJX, I believe, is the the uh, the main company, and it has um, Home Goods, um, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, and like one other store, something trading. I can't remember the name of it, but I think one, or it probably has more stores. I don't know, but um, these are all sister stores, and the clearance right now has been like really crazy at TJ Maxx and Marshalls. I think it's because the season is coming to a close, and um, actually a lot of stores I've gotten stuff from. Um, Nordstrom Rack, Ross, you know, lots of different stores are having crazy, um, crazy clearance right now. Please excuse the mess. If you see anything in the background that's really messy, it's because we're about to do some, some major cleaning up in the house. I mean, we're currently doing it right now. So anyway, um, yeah, so these are my purchases. I've got huge bag here, huge bag here, and I got another bag, but I'm probably going to return it. So I'm not even going to show it. I'm going to return some of this stuff too, actually. Uh, I'm, I mean, I'm still making up my mind. Anyway, found a lot of designer brand stuff at this particular TJ Maxx. And I've often said, I think it's kind of messed up because this is the best TJ Maxx I've ever been to. It was the best stocked. I mean, it had so much stuff, so much clearance. And designer, the designer brands were incredible. And this was a TJ Maxx in a very upscale part of the city in Dallas so and I've noticed the same thing at DSW nor um, Nordstrom Rack not so much but I've noticed that some stores are better in some areas than other stores and I understand I kind of understand why um, but I kind of don't understand I mean I, I don't like it in some ways but oh well I just travel up there anyway so um, so yeah this one had a whole lot of great designer brands all right I'm hoping that I won't I won't um, shake the camera too much I'm sorry if I do, I'm sorry in advance. All right, let me do this back first. This stuff I'm probably gonna return. I didn't, I mean, those jeans for sure because I didn't fit them, couldn't fit them. So yeah, okay, first up are these, like I mentioned, these jeans that are too small. These are rag and bone jeans. Really cool. And, uh, the price was ten dollars. Oh, and I signed up for the TJ Maxx card, the, the credit card, so I got ten percent off of all this stuff. So ten dollars. I mean nine bucks technically. And these were probably closer to two hundred dollars when they were being sold, or more. I don't know though. Okay, this it fits, but I'm not in love with it. This is Theory. This was twelve bucks. Twin ten percent off of twelve bucks. It's a little halter, halter top, $12. And the price tag says, where's the price tag? The theory price tag, where is it? I think it was $195, $190, yep. $190, oh, here's the front of the tag. Theory, I love theory. And here's um, like a crop, a flared crop top. I don't know if that's what you call it. By um, AG, originally 55 bucks. Where's the AG? Oh, here's the AG, Ad Adriano Goldschmied. And this was five bucks. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it or not. Of course, my, my rule of thumb typically is if something is 90% off, so yeah, 55 bucks normally, so this could have been 550. I'll buy it. If it's 90% off, I'll buy it. Unless I'm really in love with it, and then I'll, I'll actually do like 75, 70%, sometimes 50% if I'm really, I'll buy something on clearance for 50% off um, instead of my whole, you know, 90%. <laughs> but yeah, so, oh, here, tag came off. Okay, this I love. This was $30. $30, compare it. Oh, and their compare at prices a lot of times are, sometimes, I mean, a lot of times they're spot on, but sometimes they're actually, the actual price is lower lower than the um i mean their compare price is a lot lower sometimes than the normal the normal uh price for instance this one says compare at 198 this skirt and it had the tag the price on the price tag it had it on the tag right here <laughs> and this skirt is by what's the name of them black black fleece by um brooks brothers 
price tag right here. $5.95. I paid 30, 30 bucks for this. And I've actually been looking for skirts like this. Like kind of flared midi skirts. Mid-length, like calf length or right below the knee. I've been looking for those. So that was perfect. Very, very nice. I keep the price tag with that one. These, I don't know why these were sitting in there. Tory Burch. Tory Burch plain white they're probably this cheap because summer is almost over and they're probably trying to get rid of their white items he has a basic basic pair of um slacks i wouldn't say they're they're slacks exactly they're just a pair of white pants by tori birch i forgot how much they were when i looked them up but compare at price 200 i think they were closer to 300 10 dollars and with the uh percent off it was nine bucks these i absolutely adore these I adore these two here let me just grab both of them these two skirts both maxi maxi skirts both like this kind of lace lace well this one's kind of like lace and this one's not but they go all the way down to the floor Slightly different. No, they're pretty much the same color. Both of them are Alice and Olivia. This one right here was twenty dollars on the, the left. Twenty bucks. It says MSRP four eighty five. Twenty bucks and two percent off. I mean ten percent off, of course. So that was eighteen dollars. This one was six hundred and ninety eight dollars, <laughs> and they fit me perfectly. This was a size six. The other one is a size four. This one fits better than the, uh, it's too long. I, I think they make some of this stuff for models. A woman would have to be like 5'10 to be able to fit this one perfectly without it dragging on the floor. But I'm probably going to take it in and have it, um, have it uh, hemmed or something. I don't know. So yeah, $500 skirt, $700 skirt. This one was 30 bucks with 10% off. But yeah, that lace, I love anything that's lace pretty much. So these are gorgeous. Oh, and this has lining up to like right above the knee, and this is fully lined all the way down. Yep, so I'm really in love with those. In love with them. Love that lace. Look at that. Oh, that's gorgeous. It's so soft. The last, the $700 one is so soft. Okay, and I love stripes. I've been getting into stripes more recently. This is by Calypso. This was seven bucks, I believe. Calypso is a really good brand. Calypso St. Barth. Yeah, Calypso St. Barth. It's very soft, very basic striped tee. This was seven bucks. And um, it says compare at 50, but it was probably more. Who knows? Calypso is a decent... I mean, a really nice brand, decent brand. This is another rag and bone item. I actually got this in a, a cream color pants too. They're the rag and bone Sally pants, I believe. Sally pants, uh-huh. And this is rugby tan. This is like almost like a rose though. It kind of comes off as like a tan rose kind of color and it's beautiful. This is silk, I believe, pleat. It's pleated. It's a little long, so I'm gonna get them hemmed. They're so long, they actually drag the floor when they were at the store, so they're a little dirty. Same with the white skirts over there. Well, one of them, the long one, is a little dirty on the bottom. So yeah, I'm probably gonna get these hemmed because again, they're too long. I don't know who was bring who uh, who uh, took all this stuff. I don't know. My friend thinks maybe Neiman Marcus, since Neiman Marcus is right. This TJ Maxx was like right across the street from a really high-end mall. So my friend was thinking maybe may, maybe Neiman's was like donate not donating, but like uh, maybe they took the stuff over there. I don't know. These were these I believe retailed for three four hundred. When I looked them up, they were like three ninety five or something. Got them for eighteen dollars, and they're really really nice. I love them. They fit perfectly. The white pair, which was almost exactly the same, it was the, it was a Sally pant also, but um. Sally pants also however they they were a size six so they were too big and also I mean they're supposed to fit kind of large I like how these fit though these were slimmer on me they're a size two technically too small but I like how they fit better than the other one and the, the material is softer that I mean the, the the rugby tan is softer 
Theory, Theory Blazer. Price tag right here, extra buttons, cool. Here's Theory. Price tag says $4.55. And this is actually kind of like a blazer jacket. It's khaki material, which I love. And I love this, this tan color khaki. Anyway, so yeah, this was $500. I mean, 450 Pretty much 500 And this, I paid $15 for it. I could not believe it when I saw this. And it was a size, it's a size 4, is it? 6, size 6, my perfect size. I'm like four, six, depending on what the uh, brand is. It all depends on the brand, actually. I can fit ten and something. Oh, I didn't notice that. I have to get that cleaned. Might be why it was on clearance. But I'll get that cleaned at the uh, cleaners. Yep, depends on what brand, what the brand is, as to you know what size I wear. A G, Adriano Goldschmidt. These are really nice. I like these a lot. I forgot the name of them, but they are leggings, jeggings. 15 bucks, 10% off. Look at this pattern. It's like a snake print pattern. It's really cool. And they have a lot of give to them, so I love them. I don't like the jeans that... I'm always saying this in my videos. I don't like jeans that can't move. I feel very restricted. Very constricted in them. <laughs> yep, so these were 15 bucks, 15%, I mean 10% off. And this, I don't know if you can see that, but it's a nice blue color. This is frame denim, frame denim, really nice. I've been looking for a pair of boyfriend jeans for the longest, a nice pair that actually fit. These are perfect. There were two pairs there of the exact same jeans. I probably should have grabbed them, probably should have grabbed them because when I brought these home, they fit perfectly. Frame jeans and they were 15 bucks. And frame jeans are, um, um frame denim. Frame denim jeans are like 200 or a little more. And the bottom is cuffed. That's why I didn't buy the other pair because I don't want two pair of the exact same jeans. I don't know. I may go back and get the other pair if they're still there. But these fit beautifully. So I was so excited to find those. Let me see if there's anything else in here. Ooh. Oh yeah, this. don't need to show you what else is in there. It's undergarments. <laughs> also on clearance. But this is Tracy Reese. This skirt is really nice. I love this. I love basic, basic black skirts because I'm I am so a dress skirt girl. Grew up wearing dresses a lot and I love them. It was a religious thing when I was little, but now I just I love. I love dresses. So anyway, um, let's see, where's his name? Tracy Reese. Tracy Reese. Very good brand. This was, where is it? Uh-oh. Where's the price tag? Probably put it in a pocket. I don't know where the price tag is, but I believe this was $10. 10 bucks for this beautiful skirt. And it's kind of, it was kind of, well, it's, it's an interesting pattern. I should have showed you while it was still there. Anyway, so yeah, that was TJ Maxx. And then Marshalls. Marshalls, I also found a pair of mother jeans. I like mother jeans. They're very comfortable. I haven't even tried these on yet. I got them yesterday. They were $16. Normally, I think mother jeans are closer to $200. And yeah, they're really nice. They actually have this on the bottom of them. So I don't know what to do about that. I haven't tried them on yet. If they look weird, I'll just take them back. Not even gonna try to sell them. Mother jeans have the little M on the pocket. Kind of cool. So yeah, that's those, 16 bucks. Oh, and this too. I had like $20 store credit last week at Marshall's. And um, I found this Kuba bag. It's $400 Kuba bag. Gorgeous. I love this style. This uh, satchel style with zip top, cute little tassel. What I love most, of course, is the, uh, I love the shape, but what I love most is um, two handles and then the long strap. This is so perfect for me with the young kids. Perfect size and everything. But I love being able to, you know, carry it if I want to or, you know, hold it on my shoulder. 
if I want to. So yeah, this is the, I forgot the name of it. Oh, the Leander, the Cuba Elander, um, Leander bag. And this color is gorgeous. This green color is gorgeous. 400 bucks, and this was $49. And so with the um, store credit, I ended up paying like $35, which is fantastic for Cuba. Gorgeous bag. Okay, and then yesterday, I found these the same day I went and um, saw the mother jeans. These are by Paul Deliso. I had never heard of them until I found these sandals. And what's funny is I actually bought these like last month. Bought them last month. Um, actually, not far from that TJ Maxx in that little ritzy area. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I saw these and they were 39 bucks. I snatched them up. And, um, but I bought a whole lot of other shoes at this around the same time. So I ended up taking these back last week to my own Marshalls here where I live. And then I went back yesterday to, you know, just glance at their clearance. And I saw these on clearance again for 20, 21 bucks. So I rebought them, repurchased them. <laughs> I mean, I liked them in the first place. It's just, I didn't feel like spending 40 bucks at the time, but 20, $20 ain't bad. Okay. And last thing this right here the most interesting purse i have seen in a very very long time this is mark by mark jacobs and oh shoot i forgot i think this is the, his out loud mark by mark jacobs out loud crossbody and it looks like a cassette player and i really like that because it's kind of reminiscent of when i was born i'm 33 born in 83 so you know in the late 80s and the 90s we were uh, sporting these uh, cassette players. Oh, and this has uh, an area. It says Mark by Mark Jacobs on there. Area where you put your you put your phone in here, and then you put your 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 um, earbuds through this hole, and you can listen to it. So yeah. So yeah, I, I thought that uh, bag was just really. This bag, I thought it was just really cool. The original retail price was $348. They had this thing on sale. Oh, oh, I saw it when it was normal price, I believe, like months ago. It's been sitting in that Marshalls for months. It was $59 bucks for some reason. <laughs> it could have been more expensive. It was $59 when it was being sold. Yesterday, I found this thing for $15. 15 bucks, you guys. Oh, and these buttons up here, we have record rewind play fast forward stop they actually press down coolest thing ever and this opens like this and here's the crossbody strap in here and it's just a basic oh and you can actually see through this a little bit see that so you can kind of see the contents in your purse a little so anyway yeah it's just basic in there the basic uh basic bag so yeah coolest bag ever and I was thinking of selling it but then I realized no you know what I like that I grew up with cassette players I actually had at least one that I can remember so yeah I'm, I'm, a, I'm gonna sport this thing and besides it's such, I love Mark Jacobs and Mark by Mark Jacobs I mean I love both of his lines so anyway that's all of my stuff and um I, I recorded a thrift haul, but the lighting was horrible. I may just release it anyway. I mean, I may just make it public for you guys to see anyway, but I don't know. I don't know. I may have to do it again. Anyway, so yeah, that's my stuff. And um, if you have a TJ Maxx or a Marshalls close to you, maybe even Home Goods. I haven't even been in there recently, but they probably have a whole lot of stuff in there too. Go ahead and check it out, you guys. Stores are going crazy with the clearance right now because of the in the season. Summer is coming to a close. Um, well, the warm seasons in general are just coming to a close. So a lot of stores are starting to bring out the, um, booties and the sweaters and, you know, big boots, little boots and all that kind of stuff and, um, jackets and all that. So you can find, um, the thinner, lighter weight, white, um, shorts, sandals, all that kind of stuff. And like the really light colored stuff, you can start finding that. I mean, you can find it in stores for like, um, cheaper on clearance because you know stores are getting rid of them or they want to get rid of them so anyway that's my haul and um i hope you all are having a fantastic week i mean i hope you had a fantastic week i hope you have a fantastic weekend all right y'all 
I'll probably do one of these um, from Nordstrom again too because I've been doing some damage at Nordstrom Rack also. So um, we'll see. All right. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.